Hey, Trevor Anderson here with Channel Flux. I wanted to introduce you to our first episode of our brand new series, Let's Read. It's like a let's play, only with books. Today, A Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickens. Chapter One, The Period. <clears throat> it was the best of times. It was the worst of times. It was the age of wisdom. It was the age of foolishness. It was the uh, epoch, uh, epic of belief. It was the epic of incredulity. You know, the English language is weird, man. It's like, there's so many words that don't, like, they don't look anything like they're supposed to, you know, sound like baloney. You know, Wednesday. Wednesday has a D in it that doesn't even come up. February, R, you know. It's just weird. I mean, like, and you, you get a lot of these words when you're reading Charles Dickens. I mean, I'm just saying, you know, dumb it down for me. You know, acetaminophen. I had, to, I had to learn how to say it like Scarface in order to get that. Acetaminophen. Huh? You want to go? Acetaminophen. So, um, where was I? Oh, um, it was the year our... Uh, it was the year of our Lord, 1,700, and I mean, it just sucks, you know? I mean, like, you, you, you go to class or whatever, and, like, the teacher just calls you out, and it, it's like she chose you because it has, like, words that you never say in normal conversation, but of course, you know, she calls you out on it. Um, you know, like, e epoch. When was the last time you used that in a conversation? Epoch. Epic. Yeah, I mean, epoch, of course. I mean, maybe I'm just an idiot, you know? Like, of course that's epic. Duh. You know? Oh, I got to read the hand. Where am I? Uh, cut off um, his tongue, torn out with pincers, and his body burned alive because he has not... You know, maybe teachers could just stop embarrassing students. You know, that might be cool. Like, if, you know, teachers were to just shut up and, like, you know... Let students read at their own pace. Maybe don't make me look like an idiot. Because then I start f***ing up words I know how to say. Like, I know how to say this word. You know, suspicion that they were awake. I know how to say that. I don't, I don't need help. You know? Jeez. I mean, like, you shouldn't embarrass people in general. Like, I, like the, I mean, granted, there was one time where me and my family, we went to um, this Piccadilly restaurant. I don't know if you know what Piccadilly is, but anyway, we went to Piccadilly's and my brother's standing there and he's oblivious to the fact that this kid just shit his pants, like all over himself. And it was disgusting. And I'm just like, oh my God. And he does not know. So he keeps going, does everyone smell that? It smells like shit. And we're like, Tommy, shut up, shut up, Tommy. You're an idiot. And he's like, no, seriously, you guys don't smell that, it's disgusting. So anyway, oh, um, along the roads that lay before them. <laughs> My God, man, that's, that's some good reading right there. Hey, if you wanna keep watching more content like that, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Next time we're going to be reading the book, Plantagenet History of 17th Century Colonies. God damn it, fuck. 